Chefs and restaurant owners are optimists. That's why despite everything that's going on, new restaurants continue to open. Today we're going to take a look at three new restaurants opening in the new year. Chatty's Pizzeria in Bay Village, Dante's new project Goma Downtown, and we're going to head over to Lakewood, hit Lindy's Lake House, which is going to become Bar Italia any day now. So I'm here with Matt Harlan, a.k.a. Chatty, at Chatty's Pizzeria in Bay Village. First, before we go one step further, Matt, tell us about Chatty. Where would that nickname come from? Well, back in the day, before I had any responsibilities or cares, I was just a young punk in the corner that didn't shut up. <laughs> and uh, one of our servers nicknamed me Chatty Matty, and uh, Michael and the staff loved it. You mentioned Michael. Uh, you're talking about Michael Simon. Uh, you worked for him for 23 years. Correct me if I'm wrong, making you the second longest employee of... of uh, his company? Second one, yeah, no. And I imagine, the beach is right there, I imagine in summer, uh, you've got a patio, but that patio extends. Uh, you've got live music in the back, I understand, in the summer. What's it like um, here um, in the summer? It doesn't stop. I'm looking at three things right here. Tell us what we've got in front of us. Uh, so, meatball sub, just a classic sub. A burrata salad, which is something that, you know, my wife and I would eat at home. And then uh, a mortadella sandwich, which I've come to love mortadella over the last decade. It's, it's the original bologna, right? <laughs> Cheers, Matt. Cheers. I'm here with Rick Duty, owner of Seventeen River Grill. Uh, also Cedar Creek Grill in Beechwood, and we're here in what was Lindy's Lake House, but it's now Bar Italia. Uh, did you change this restaurant overnight, Rick? No, nah, it's been a few weeks. We just didn't want to do another Italian restaurant. Um, we wanted to specialize on in, in things that we could do hopefully extremely well. Uh, that's why you see three pastas in, the, in front of you. Um, we're actually not doing pizza in this restaurant. Uh, that is um, intentional. They're the kind of dishes that you can enjoy tonight for dinner and tomorrow for lunch, right? Well, I used to feed my entire family that way. We really would prefer to leave the experts to doing what they do best. Um, in this case, uh, we tried uh, a number of different pastas. We felt like uh, Matt from Flower was a uh, flour pasta company. He has a great product. He's got a great following. And the same goes with the bread. Um, the best bakery, in my opinion, in the city uh, I'm sure that could be refuted as on the rise. We love them. Um, we talk to them. We're excited to serve their breads. So Dante, uh, you first announced this project two years ago. You took over the, uh, the Canado space, prime spot on a prime street in the heart of downtown. Uh, what did you like about that space? In the front, we're gonna tear down those windows and there'll be garage doors. So from outside, you can see all the way through the whole restaurant once it's, once it's finished. But the sushi bar, right? center stage right in the middle it's all once again wide open so japanese fusion it's a it's a loose term um obviously sushi uh, what are some of the other things that uh, people can look forward to in the kitchen will be more of a fusion uh just kind of doing what you know what i was used to doing in california working for the for the mandarin there and um you know i have a lot of i'm putting in a walk station which is something i've never had in, in, in any restaurant so we're gonna do a lot of a lot of sauteed wok dishes um we're gonna do some tobanyaki dishes and I understand you've got a large downtown uh, downstairs space to work with. What are you What are you planning for that? Down there is going to be a speakeasy cocktail lounge with a secret entrance, and you're going to have to figure out how to get in and figure out who you know to get it. But <laughs> something, uh, yeah, a little more exclusive, a little more fun. So I definitely won't be coming there. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. 